Hi, I, I just wanted to start a new video series and it's going to be something spontaneous. So that's what I'm going to call it, spontaneity. This will be the first in spontaneity and, um, well, basically it's just me talking to you off the top of my head um, about what's going on and, you know, just trying to... Um, see life in a better light, um, you know, prayer and meditation helps sometimes, and quiet and stillness, and then other times, I'm listening to music, you know, and um, music can help me focus, uh, AM radio, just listening to talk radio, um, I don't know about you, but I had to... I've had to many times um, depart, detach from my TV because I don't know what it is about me, but, well, I do. Uh, I have a, addictive tendencies, and um, if I have a TV around, it really breaks my peace of mind. Even when I can say here in my apartment, uh, the TV was two rooms away because the kitchen is next to me, and the back room where I keep my bicycles um, and just some paperwork, that room had the TV in it. And the draw, the draw upon my spirit at times when I was attempting to sit here at my desk and focus and uh, work on my many writing projects, as you probably know, uh, or if you don't, uh, I'm a blogger and I publish poetry and I um, am working on a novella, the first in a series and last year I published, well actually two years ago now, in 2013, in late 2013 I published, self-published my first novel on Amazon and it was just such a wonderful process you know because it was such a long-held dream come true and I know that others feel this way too but for me I've always seen myself as a writer um, the times when I used to drink I don't drink anymore but I was um, I would bring my journal into the bar and I would sit there and write poetry or sketches um, you know um, word sketches uh, just while drinking whiskey at the bar with um, people I didn't know, uh, who all thought I was very strange, <laughs> and that's okay, <laughs> you know, but anyways, I just wanted to share a little bit more, um, these will be slightly tangential, uh, recollections, or, um, maybe trying to be helpful to you in some way, and, because I, I'm not trying to just think of myself anymore, I've spent years, um, uh, of self-centeredness, you know, and, it got me virtually nowhere, so I am trying to reach out to community both in my personal life and online and build community. Um, it's not easy for me because it's not something I used to strive for, you know, but hey, some of us grow up slowly and um, I also uh, consider myself serious-minded and purposeful. I have intention and dreams. I'm trying to make realities here for myself and um, hopefully to inspire others such as yourself to also pursue your dreams, you know, because even the most impossible dreams furthest away from you, uh, I can speak for myself that in 2012, late 2012, I had nothing except a, a rented out um, vehicle that my friend was allowing me to stay in um, just north of Oakland and uh, I had nothing honestly and from there I opened my heart and um, I have a higher power and um, I just chose to turn my will over to some extent to 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 the fullest extent possible on any given day and let a, a greater will
carry me um, and basically to just put effort into being present and being helpful and staying positive in my life you know and and staying real you know not hiding behind anything substance person um title you know just trying to be myself um and it's not been easy you know because i've typically been hiding behind something in the past whether it's been those things i just mentioned and um Today it requires courage, you know, um, but I have love in my heart and uh, this is spontaneity number one. Thanks. Have a great day.